Dave Marlin, asleep on from your triumph the third time. Does it get better? I don't know. I am still can't believe what's actually just happened, so I'm still sort of processing it. This place, Warilla Bowls Recreation Club, I mean, it's treated you pretty well. Mate, this would have to be my favourite place to play. I've won so many tournaments here. It has been wonderful. So very, very happy man at the moment. <laughs> One of the advantages, I guess, now is that Unlike last time, you're going to have two weeks. You get to Wollongong, your family's going to be there, and you've got Townsville under your belt, so you've got used to that. You know, I know sometimes you're an anxious person. You were anxious yes. last night. <laughs> oh, yes, I was very anxious last night. <laughs> very um, nerdy. But you're going to be able to kind of get that a little bit out of the system, aren't you? Absolutely, yeah. And, and doing it 2017, it sort of gave me a little bit of experience on there. I know it's still going to be nervous, but you've just got to have your head right. And I know I've worked hard, so I've just got to keep doing what I've been doing. And hopefully they come out on stage. That'll be great if they did. <laughs> so you're going to have to hit up Paul Cotton, not just uh, practice in the garage? Uh, we've already spoken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll have a couple of practice sessions before I hit Townsville. But uh, I've got to say now, I'm, I'm sort of processing. I'm really looking forward to Wollongong. I think I've got... I know I've got so much support down there. I have family in the crowd. I've got to think, it's going to be noisy. <laughs> it's going to be real noisy. And that final last night, you you know, you know, went in there confidently. You'd had a good semi-final behind you, but you knew that Joe had done you the night before and he'd, he'd played really well to make the final as well. You just hit him hard early and then just kept him front. Yeah, that's what I had to do. I knew how well he played the day before. Well, it was Sunday, yeah, day before. I'm losing track of days. It's been that. <laughs> but, um, no, he, he came out of the blocks really hard the day before, and I knew you know, I have to get a good start on him. If I can get a good start on him, I might sort of break him down a bit. And I, I really enjoyed it. I've had two games with him this weekend. First time I met him, and both of them have been cracking games. What a great player. And uh, finally, I know Darts Down Under gives you a Dump Marlin real estate I'd mention every now and again, but I suspect you're going to be able to get that out there on a whole different scale now. I think so, and thanks for the support, mate. All good. Thank you, and well done. Thanks.